wanted to take, can she make out of the kitchen and bring it into the craft room? Can she make a mask that fits? Spoiler alert, not yet. But I did want to show you all of these masks that I made. I'm going to upload the masks individually. It's an individual video. And then I will upload all three masks as a longer video. And this is a disposable mask that I do a little short segment on how I make it work for me. Come along on the journey and you know, this is a series that could in theory never end because who knows, I might not be able to find a mask that fits this face. By the way, I'm uploading them almost all at one time. Uh, I guess disclaimer, these masks obviously aren't going to do the protection level as an N95 mask. However, sometimes I feel something's better than nothing. And uh, I'm tired of using disposable things. Type one. It takes me longer to cut the fabric and figure out how to cut the fabric than it does to actually make the mask. I'm not joking here. Just so you know, this is not a dull blade. I've only cut two things with it. Hair ties for this one. Yes, I make hair ties out of tights. Okay, here is my fabric for this mask. And what I'm going to do is take it to the sewing machine and sew right here. I could iron it, but I'm just, for simplicity, to see if it fits, gonna do it just like this. All right, seam in the middle. For some clips and hair ties. And let's see. One. I don't know, that looks pretty good to me. And then, Put this around here and this around here. Okay. Let's clip this clip at the top. over here on the side. I gotta say guys, this is pretty easy. This is a simple two layer mask, just like the next one I'll be doing. Um, one thing I did not think about was putting a nose piece in this one but I'm pretty sure I could have done that in the print set before this. All right, so here's my mask. Now, I can tell the downside of this one is that I don't have a nose clip. It is, wait, did I put it on inside out? No, I did not. Uh, because it's the same fabric, I can't tell which is inside and not inside. 
Um, I also did not put my nose clip on there, so I, I can't get a good seal with this mask. This really is a no-go at all for me. Um, and I don't know if it's because it doesn't have a nose mask, a nose thing, but it feels like it's sliding. And um, really, there's just too much air. Ooh. There's too much, there's too much of an air situation coming out of the top of the mask and also the sides of the mask. Um, and the bottom flap. So, so to me, this is this one is a no go. Even though it is really easy to sew, and if if this works for you, that is fantastic. It just does not work for me. But it out of all of them, this one was absolutely the easiest to sew. making it very difficult to breathe. I wish that I could get a mask that didn't, like, it presses down on my nose so hard, and I don't know if it's because I got a big nose or what the deal is. See you later. Bye.